me to present to you an ancient mystery that goes back many thousands of years. The mystery of the cups and the balls. We have not one ball, not two, but three balls. Where is the third, I hear you ask. Well, I spin my wand and I just make the ball appear on the cup like this. I take ball number one, as quickly as the ball appeared on the cup, it will now vanish. Ball number two. Again, I'm going to make this ball vanish exactly the same as before, just a little bit differently, that's all. And last but not least, ball number three. This time I'm going to let you see the ball vanish. Where do they go? Back underneath their cups. Now I shall eliminate the magical wand. I will remove a ball. And I'll also remove one of the cups. And I will place that over here for later. Now we have here two cups. One for each ball. Now I'm going to cause the ball to change places. Not really. I'm going to cause this ball to vanish and reappear over here. Too many cups, too many balls. I'll get rid of one of the balls. And I'll even get rid of one of the cups. And I'll place that over there like this. One ball. One cup. I take the ball here. I cause it to vanish and reappear underneath. Just like this. I take the ball again, place it in my pocket. Where's the ball? You say in your pocket, you're absolutely right. Wrong. It's underneath the cup. I take the ball again, place it into my pocket. Where is the ball? And you say it's underneath the cup. Absolutely right. One, two, three cups. One ball. I place the ball in my pocket and I now ask you, where would you like the ball to reappear? You see the centre cup? Not bad. Two, three, and last but not least, one of your five a day. Little routine by Michael Amar, the world famous cups and balls. Hope you enjoyed it.